Many of the islanders are employed by the production of a very unique fabric that is only made here, Harris Tweed. And we're hoping to learn how it's made and how people live here. We are at a, the home of a weaver who uh, works with the mill. This is Martine, my new friend. Yeah. You guys should get a tweed jacket made out of And I'm going to open a, a, just one wear. tweed jacket Mexican that goes over both of us. Oh, oh yeah. I'm burned. At least you've heard of Harris Tweed in America anyway. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Some local bikers we'd met explained to us that many of the colors in the fabric are inspired by the colors of the hills here in the Hebrides. So we figured we should stop by the actual factory and get a tour from Margaret, their sales director. So at this stage of the process, we're actually blending our wool together. So we're gonna take our base colors and we're going to blend anything from two to eight different colors together to create our yarn colors. So the blended wool is now ready to start the carding process. And what they're gonna do is brush out every individual wool fiber so that we have our fibers all in a straight line. So that twist is what gives it strength. Yeah. So before this mill was here 10 years ago, what were these people doing? Various jobs. The younger ones wouldn't have had employment in the industry at all. So weaving really helps to build those village communities as well. Yeah. So this is the loom that all of those home weavers are using. So uh, if I wanted to become a weaver and move here... Be my guest, you can come <laughs> round here right now and try this if you wish. You I'll try it. Faster? That's good. Keep it going across. Steady Eddie. Yeah. here for a while. Oh, nice. This is Ian, who's with us from the Harris Tweed oh, Authority. Martin. So oh, Ian is right. one of only three um, Harris Tweed inspectors that will come to the mill and they will inspect every single meter of Harris Tweed that's manufactured. Harris Tweed only becomes Harris Tweed at this inspection table. It's effectively owned by the community of the Outer Hebrides and they are the guardians of the ore. So each, if you wanted to become a Harris Tweed weaver, you need right. to live on the Outer Hebrides. And so we could rent the home and then we would need to buy a loom? You would need to buy a loom, yes. And how much is a loom? Best part of £20,000 plus. Whoa, okay. Can you do like a payment plan or? No. Layway. No. Mm. So cash. it's just cash. So we're probably not going to become weavers, but maybe we could become capable TV show hosts. <laughs>